Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines, brought to you by PU Prime. Hello and welcome to Friday's Daily Financial Report. Wall Street's main indexes were mixed in volatile trading as investors remained cautious ahead of a crucial labor report later in the week and monitored potential escalations in Middle East hostilities. The International Monetary Fund renewed calls pressuring El Salvador to scale back its Bitcoin policies and overhaul its regulatory framework surrounding the digital asset. Julie Kosak, director of the IMF's communications department, did not specify the exact details behind the proposed regulatory shift. Traders gauging how to best play a sliding US dollar are eyeing the relative strength of economies around the world as rate cuts from global central banks shake up currency markets. The US dollar index fell 4.8% against the basket of currencies in the third quarter of 2024. The dollar-yen pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, rising 0.2%. The ROC is giving a positive signal. The Bitcoin dollar pair rose 0.1% in the last session, after gaining as much as 1.3% during the session. The RSI is giving a negative signal. The gold dollar pair saw a minor dip of 0.1% in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The oil dollar pair skyrocketed 3.9% in the last session. According to the CCI, we are in an overbought market. The U.S. average hourly earnings will be released at 12.30 GMT. The U.S. non-farm payrolls at 12.30 GMT. Italy's retail sales at 9 GMT. The French industrial output will be released at 6.45 GMT. Japan's CFTC JPY NC net positions at 19.30 GMT. The U.K.'s CFTC GBP NC net positions at 19.30 GMT. We hope you've enjoyed Friday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.